talking about stuttering in the workplace can be really hard. Many of us are used to hi hi hiding our stuttering, especially at work. But sometimes there comes a point where that approach just doesn't work anymore. We realize that the things we do to hide our stuttering at, at, at work can have a really negative effect on our performance, our work relationships, and even our ability for career ad advancement. I'm Pam Mertz. And I'm Mara Ormond. And if you're like us, you've probably spent a lot of time and energy hiding and feeling bad about stuttering at work. Whether our coworkers already know we stutter or whether we're pretty sure that they have absolutely no idea, opening up about stuttering can be unbearably painful. But all the hiding and not talking about it isn't working either. It can feel like we're backed into a corner. You're right. And that's why we've designed an online workshop to explore disclosing stuttering at work. We'll talk about disclosing in many work-related sit situations like the dreaded job interview, which we know can be the most stressful for pe people who stutter, during the workday, when meeting new col col colleagues, and more. We'll address the really complex layers involved with whether, when, and how we should act, act, actually choose to disclose stuttering at work. There is no one-size-fits-all approach to d disclosing stuttering. And the goal of this workshop is to help you figure out what works best for you. Pam and I will share some experiences that we've had with disclosure in the workplace and the most important lessons that we have learned and there will also be lots of time for you to ask questions and share your ideas. Please join us and we look forward to seeing you there.